party on the Capitol lawn, asking you which side you're on, drawing battle lines in this country. Oh, and this song goes out to fucking whoever punches Brandon Darby directly. <laughs> Underpaid but overloaded, clinging hard to what we own, trying to win the rat race. Well, so you hate taxes on the working poor, unless of course they're for the war or put the wall along the border. But not for nurses or doctors, priorities flip the way it looks to me, and I work hard as shit for my money. But I don't believe in an economy that forces folks to crawl. Yeah! Keep part of the capital on and Sarah Palin singing along, but she never learned the lyrics. Tea party on the Capitol lawn, asking you which side you're on, drawing battle lines in this country. Oh, but there's something about our worldview, something about the lens we look through that keeps us from building something new that works out better for more of us. Well, it's in the cracks where the levees broke, it's in the cash gold that sacks stole, it's in the fields of tomatoes where the legacy of slavery wrong. It's a hatred born of jealous fear, a hatred born of bread right here. It's xenophobic and insecure with a deadly outcome. It's a racism that grows and thrives from religion. Justify. An endless list of human rights denied in the name of liberty. Tea party in the Capitol lawn, the Christian terrorists are singing along, getting ready for the race war. Now you're telling me immigrants should go back home. I say no, the ground that you're standing on. Because Arizona was Mexico and your grandparents were European. Heroes like Thomas Paine were immigrants when they came and called themselves Americans. And that's how it's always been. But Maria and Juan didn't steal our jobs, they were outsourced by Bill and Ron. As South America's wealth was robbed by U.S. corporations. So when they dumped the tea in Boston, it was an attack against the corporation. So I don't see the connection between that story and yours. And Christmas addicts in the Boston dead weren't fighting for a white nation. They were fighting an occupation like the Iraq and Afghan wars. Tea party on the Capitol lawn, asking you which side you're on, drawing battle lines in this country.